Peace. Infinite Waters diving deep once again. Beautiful deep divers, you are amazing. I hope your day is going good. It's such a beautiful day. I could just fall asleep in nature, but I'm gonna share this video with you. Is someone disrespecting your energy? Do you really want to learn how to respect your own energy? How to respect your energy? Five signs from the universe. You're respecting your energy. Let's just... Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Now, respecting your energy, deep divers, is all about saying, talk to the hand, because I don't want to listen to what you have to say. <laughs> it's all about really realizing how precious your energy is. And I meet a lot of people who say, Ralph, people are draining my energy. I walk around these cities and it feels like my energy is being sucked out of me. How can I really learn how to respect my energy? Is that you, Deep Diver? Well, by the end of this video, you are going to respect your energy and you are going to be walking around with the best energy in the world and we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello there? Deep Divers, let's just... Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. That's right. So... Let me share with you what's helped me along my journey to respect my energy. I'm a Pisces, as you know, and many water signs, shout out to all the Scorpios, Cancers, <laughs> are very prone to pick up other people's energies. We're very sensitive. I'm very sensitive, but actually sensitivity is a superpower. Okay. And I'll explain why later on. <laughs> But growing up, it was hard because sometimes I would be around certain friends, family, even random strangers and just pick up their energy. And I'm like, how can I really learn how to respect my energy? Then I found out, actually, I am respecting my energy. I am respecting my energy. The first sign from the universe, you're respecting your energy, deep divers, is that for the first time, you've allowed yourself to say a big, fat, no. Mm. Slow motion this side. Because mm. it feels so good to say no. Like when you really want to say no and you finally have the courage to say no. No, no. And you're not afraid anymore. You're not afraid to say that word no. When someone asks you out, no. Do you want to go here? No, 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 no. And like you just keep on saying no, 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 that you've gotten so much confidence right now because for the first time you are respecting your energy. You're putting your own needs first. In other words, you are learning the art of self-care. And that's how to know you are respecting your energy. You see, it's all energy. And there comes a point in time where you have to stop sugarcoating everything and you have to just tell it like it is you have to stop people pleasing and growing up i wasn't good at that because i would just say yes when i was actually saying no to myself okay but over time i learned to say actually no it's okay to cancel a commitment it's okay not to answer that phone call airplane mode <laughs> it's okay to take the day off it's okay to be alone and that's how to respect your energy like a lot of the times especially when i'm in nature i turn my phone on then i turn it off <laughs> yes it's off it has to be off <clears throat> why does it have to be off deep divers because this is me time and if you are having me time, you are respecting your energy, okay? Plus, there's no, there's no signal where I am in nature most of the time, right? So it's a great way to really recharge, okay? And really get back the energy I've been giving to the cat down the road. <laughs> What's the second sign? From the universe, you're respecting your energy. Deep divers. Let's take a moment for gratitude. A moment of silence. 
I'm grateful right now because I'm respecting my own energy by being very selective with who I hang around. You see, a lot of us, we want a lot of friends. I don't have a lot of friends. I've got a few good ones and that's all I need because I would rather have a few good ones than a lot of fake ones. <laughs> and if you are someone right now, deep divers, who's very selective with who you hang around, you only hang around people who raise your frequency and you raise their frequency. You're reserving time for only those who reflect your sincerity. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. Like deep divers, I will tell you, if I hang around you, if I hang around you, it's because I really, really like you. I like your energy, okay? And you like mine, okay? <laughs> if you are someone right now who's only surrounding yourself with people who appreciate your energy, you are respecting your energy. If, however, you are surrounding yourself with people who don't respect you, who talk behind your back, who are fake and phony, you're not respecting your energy. So, check in your address. Yeah, check. <laughs> check in your address book, your phone book, and then go through all the names and say, actually, does this person really appreciate my energy? And if it's someone you really hang around with a lot, ask yourself, why am I hanging around? Why? Why or oh, why am I hanging around them? Okay. And these days I'm only connecting with people who remind me who I am. You beautiful deep divers. What's the third sign from the universe? Baby, baby, you're respecting your energy. Seven day vegan challenge. You are only consuming life, not death. You're realizing peace begins on your plate. Mm, what? Slow motion this side. Mm. You are only consuming soul food, the real soul food, <laughs> which is all about the plant-based diet. Shout out to everybody who's drinking a beautiful smoothie right now. Someone asked me, Ralph, what's your favorite smoothie? Acai, blueberry, banana, <laughs> chia seeds. I just add stuff. I just add stuff, right? And it tastes fantastic. Now I'm respecting my own energy. I'm putting the best inside me. Therefore, I'm getting the best out of me, okay? So if you are someone who is really transitioning to a plant-based diet, doing the seven day vegan challenge, shout out to you. You're really respecting your energy, but also you're respecting other life forms, which is also part of respecting your own energy. In other words, you're only consuming karma-free foods. That's how you know you're respecting your own energy. If, however, you are eating death, you're eating processed junk food, many times you are disrespecting your energy because you're not putting life in, therefore you won't get life out. So it's time to stuff a whole load of grapes in your mouth full of resveratrols. You look fabulous, by the way. What's the fourth? sign from the universe you're respecting your energy deep divers let's just woo, breathing in that good ass prana baby you are learning how to speak up you're not holding your tongue anymore no you are speaking your truth even if your voice shakes you're looking a bit shaky baby yes i am ralph but at least i'm speaking my truth good on you speak the yes speak <laughs> Speak your truth, even if your voice shakes. Like, <clears throat> deep divers, I don't hold back. I talk about anything and everything under the sun because I'm not afraid. And in turn, I know I'm respecting my own energy. Don't go out not really speaking your truth, okay? And that's how you really know you're respecting your energy because you respect your energy once you learn that when you are respecting your energy, you're actually respecting your true authenticity. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. And nothing is more authentic than speaking your truth. So speak your heart and mind without fear. If you're doing that, you are respecting your energy. And what's the fifth sign from the universe? 
deep divers, you are respecting your energy. You are letting go of baggage. You're letting go of people that weigh you down because for the first time you're realizing the only way to fly is to let go of what is weighing you down. Okay, and that's why I'm flying every single day like a bird in the sky because I'm letting go of people no longer serving me, environments no longer serving me. And that's why every single day I'm in nature, in beautiful places, beautiful beaches, just saying, feel so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello there? Respecting my energy. Deep divers, you are amazing. Respect your energy today. Set up healthy, energetic boundaries. Set up healthy, energetic boundaries. Don't be afraid to say no. Just don't say no to me or the cat down the road. <laughs> Have a beautiful day, deep divers. We're just, woo, breathing in that good ass prana, baby. So fresh, good ass prana shirts, ralphsmart.com slash clothes. Check out the good ass prana shirts there. Get more inspiration on Instagram at infinite waters. Have a beautiful day, Deep Divers. Such a beautiful day today. Such a beautiful day. Have a beautiful day. Infinite waters, diving deep once again. Stay well, stay healthy. Peace. You! Probably the best way to respect your energy is just to get high off that good ass prana, baby. <laughs>